In the toughest stance yet against TikTok, the Biden administration is reportedly threatening a possible ban of the app used by more than 100 million Americans. It's uh, just a flashpoint in a wider China-U.S. conflict, but not all Americans are on board. Fox 5 anchor Russ Spencer has more from the live desk. Alex, the Biden administration has an ultimatum for TikTok. The White House wants its Chinese owners to divest their stakes in the company or face a potential ban in the U.S. TikTok CEO says a forced sale wouldn't change much, while some politicians say new ownership isn't enough. There is bipartisan concern that the app could present national security risks with users' private information potentially going to China. But a Chinese official said today the U.S. has no evidence of that. We're concerned about the data mining. I mean, this is 80 to 100 million devices largely targeted at our youth. It does scare me a little bit, but will I stop using it? Probably not. While a ban has support in Congress, Americans are divided. A new poll finds about half support a ban on some foreign technology. Republicans and older respondents favor it more than Democrats and younger people. There's some informational videos on there I like, uh, how-to videos, and there's some funny content. TikTok has capitalized on its popularity even amid the backlash with plans to introduce a feed dedicated to STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math, and a new campaign to highlight businesses that have benefited from the app. But critics say it's just a head fake. This is just a cosmetic fix. It doesn't change the whole idea that it's a place to really get poor information, not proper information, and it's dangerous to our teens. We expect TikTok's CEO to respond to these criticisms at a congressional hearing next week. David? Russ, it was